Welcome back to Let's Play Neverwinter Nights 2 Icewind Dale. This is Big Los. And we are still on level 2 of the Vale Crypt. In the last episode, we explored the north and the south wings here. And now we're about to go into this locked door. Presumably by action. Stay of close and step where this I lever. step. This lever seems to be in working condition. Okay, um. Can we use it? Okay, so the door is now unlocked. So I'm going to send Frito to unlock it, and in the meantime... Everyone, follow me! I'm going to put on buffs. Because Yen that's what we do. Koroi. We put on buffs on ourselves. And I'm going to be putting mage armor on Sanjay. Perhaps so. Fall in behind me here. Sanjay, you can do protection from evil on yourself, shield of faith, and bless. <laughs> you just follow Four me. lambs to the you slaughter. Stay close. And we'll do shields of faith. Your gate to X. Now we have an open door. Okay, Oops. How did Frito get protection? Oh, I must have cast it over the wrong person. Well, that sucks. Anyways. Down we go. And we have a whole slew of undead, so let's try to me for some. Me. Probably won't work though. You just follow me and stay close. The Eldritch Spear, that one. Everyone, follow me. All right, so we have we have Fireball, but I think we should try Grease first because these things are about to converge on us. Put it right there. And you're turning, and hmm. you are what? Spectral guard. You're going to be attacking the skeleton. Hellhound. And we'll do blades of fire as soon as that's done. <laughs> now it won't say up. Oh. Failed, 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 failed. Because our highest level of creature affected is zero. So that means that no one got turned. I say we try again. What happened to you? Why is your movement speed? Oh, because you're greased up. Oh, you critical hit me. Did it work this time? Did it work? No. It did not work. Hellhound! Alright, after you cast that habit, you try a fireball. In fact, I would like to make a wand of this if I can find supplies for a wand. I know it's going to be expensive, but it is worth it. Let's center it on... I guess that one. Alright, you got one. Whatever gods you worship. Why is that one not even moving? That was kind of a waste. Get up this way. And fix something, will you? I think I spy some unsuspecting oh, teammates ahead. You're out of healing. You are too far away, aren't you? Try it now. What are you doing? Uh, 
I think I spy some Shouldn't unsuspecting you be in playmates casting, ahead. Like, automatically. <laughs> Sung. Wow, this is just insane. Look at all these undead. This is most unfortunate. Let's try this. This is a glyph of warding. You create a small magical zone that can detect the passage of enemy creatures. When the field is activated, it explodes, dealing 1d8 points of sonic damage for two caster levels to all creatures within the area of effect, to a maximum of 5d8. After being triggered, the glyph dissipates. And it's level 5. So that means it will do... Oh, I'm guessing 2d8 points of damage, which will probably take most of them out. Let's do it. I'm willing to risk it. Let's put it here. Right there. <laughs> Got him. Look at all those deaths. Or I should say undeaths. But I think we damaged ourselves as well. Alright, so we made a reflex save. I think we only took... No, we didn't take any damage. Destroyed the Temple Guardian. Did 13 points of damage to Evelyn. Did 15 points of damage to the Badger. Killed most everyone else. Did 13 points of damage to, uh, to Kara. And Frito made an evasion save. Sung to <laughs> Where's, where's their enemy? You will regret that. Oh, it's dead. Where are you going? Oh yeah, there's this one over here still. You know what? You don't even have to run. You can just blast it. Cure moderate wounds. Yeah, that might be a good one to do. Their doing? time Nothing. has come. Destroy them all! Alright, they're dead. And we have an enemy over here that's guarding a... I want to say an anti-chamber or... Hellhound! This way. There goes the badger. Alright, let's put some bull strength on Sunday. <gasps> Nike goes on. All right, it's dead. Anything else around here? There's another temple guardian. That will require and a mere fraction of my strike power. swiftly. <laughs> More lambs to the slaughter. Instead of doing that, why don't you blast it? This is most unfortunate. Why don't we just stay where we Quietly. are and just start Our shooting? Our quarry lies just ahead. It's a plus one, right? Oh, no, it's a, it's a bug. Yes, attack the Temple Guardian. You have the sling. You don't have to get that close to it. There you go. You're doing that. And no, stop that. Ugh. No, don't open the door. Attack the... There you go. Yeah, just spam those. That should be it. Good strategy. Some shadows just burst open this door right here. Well, Let's go back to melee weapons. 
Look what now, we have. Now, strike swiftly. Here. Future corpses. That thing's almost dead. Damn your eyes. All right, that's dead. But now we have to take care of the shadows and we're out of turn attempts. Where are you going, man? Oh, we got a trap here. And a mummy that just sprung this trap. Yeah, you're gonna have to spam like magic missiles on this thing. There's more where that came from. More magic missiles. Oh, this thing is causing ability damage. What are you doing? We got a shadow that's There's there. more where that there. came from. There it goes. I think I spy some unsuspecting yeah. playmates ahead. Spam. Spam those. Elders Blast. This thing is diseased. Fortunately, it'll go away pretty soon. Spam magic missiles. And I guess we'll have you take care of the shadows. I think I spy some unsuspecting playmates ahead. Right. Whatever uh, gods you worship. Strike swiftly. All right, let's take them uh, down. Finally, our quarry lies just ahead. Do you have constitution damage? No. Drink a couple of those. Should this feel a lot is better. most. Now, strike swiftly. Oh, crap. He's down. He didn't move far enough away. Now we have to heal. What is this? Oh, these guys burst through. We have an imbued white now. I think I spy some unsuspecting playmates ahead. Sung. Yes, of course. All right. Come over here and drink some potions. All right, crew. Let's take them down. The mummy's dead. Now we have to take care of the white. <laughs> More lambs to the slaughter. <laughs> Let's go to our sword. <laughs> Kill it. Sanjay killed it. So what do we have attacking us now over here? It doesn't say. Oh, we have two diseased characters. It's bad. This is most unfortunate. So what are you all going to attack over here? That better not be another mummy. I can't even see what's over here. How can you guys see what's over here? Everyone, follow me. I think I spy some unsuspecting yes, playmates. Of ahead. course. Quietly. I think oh, I spy attack. Some you know what? Ah, uh, now we know what's in here. Zombies. And. A mummy. I would really like to blast him with a fireball, but unfortunately I don't have any more. Oh, looks like the dire badger sprung a trap. Now everybody wants Damn to your attack, eyes. so we're going to turn off AI mode and we're going to bring everybody over here. There's really no need to rush into these things. Quietly. Our quarry lies just ahead. 
Especially after we've taken all this damage. Oh, we got more shadows in here that didn't run out. Alright, everybody can attack these things in here. This is most. Yeah, well, of course I can do shadow. that. There you go. And we'll turn on AI mode. Go on this way. This is where all the action is. Where are you going? Ah, okay, they're coming into that room. Their time has come. Destroy them all. There's no need to do that. And you know what? I'm surprised that you don't do like an Eldritch Spear. Okay, so we have some potions here. We'll grab them. We got 50 gold pieces of ruby. Potion. We got a potion of bark skin. That might be useful. Shocking grasp. Weak earth essence. That's yes. Evelyn. At least you have a spell that you can use that's kind of useful. I think it's only going to do 1d6 points of electrical damage. It doesn't say the caster level for this one. We have one more over here. All right, so we have a scroll of silence. We'll give that to Sanjay. We have a scroll of ghoul touch. We'll scribe that. We have 60 gold pieces of cold iron ingot and weak fire essence. Let's go over here and we'll equip our bow once more. That will require a mere fraction of my power. You know what? The zombie over here just spam those. You go to your sling. And see if you can bludgeon it a little Damn bit. Damn your eyes! You go to your bow. <sighs> see if you can't shoot it. <laughs> Is it actually <laughs> going anywhere? <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> All right, Sanjay killed it. We have another one. There it is. Okay. No, you don't have to attack. Just spam those. Attack! Yeah, you're doing now, one, and you're doing strike one. swiftly. <laughs> More lambs to the slaughter. Wait a minute. If I must. Aw, oh, we we brought one of those in there and it's not doing anything. What a waste. Come on out. If I must. Alright, hopefully we'll start doing something. Our quarry lies just ahead. Yeah, we'll probably have to go back to melee weapons now. Damn your eyes! If I must... Attack that thing. Attack! <laughs> Who killed it? Sanjay did. And we have another one. Might as well go back to the bow. Their time has come. Destroy them all! Damn your eyes! Yeah, just come back. And go back to your bow. Hurry up. There you go. This is most... unfortunate. <laughs> well, of course I can do that. Yeah, spam that. <laughs> there goes the badger. <laughs> there it goes. Ah, uh, here's the mummy. Now we're gonna take care of it. Spam that a bunch of times. Hellhound! Don't do that. I wanna just spam that. 
well. And just start shooting. Them Look the what we have here. Future corpses. <laughs> You know what? Just go back to your Warhammer. This is most unfortunate. Ah, <laughs> oh, you're suffering from ability damage again. Their time has come. Lost. Hellhound. Oh my God. 24 points of damage. That is horrible. And you are completely out of cure spells. This is probably the worst situation that we've been in. That fraction of my power. Yeah, this is definitely the worst situation. Because there's no way that we can we can raise him now. There's nothing that we can do. Absolutely nothing. Attack! We have no way of curing. Quietly. Our quarry lies just ahead. We can't have him drink a potion. He's... He's out for the count. Well... Look what we I have I mean, we could here. do stabilize, but Future I doubt that'll leave corpses. Him. No, not that one. I doubt this will even work. Quietly, our quarry lies just ahead. Attack! And then we'll have you just leave the area. It didn't stabilize him, though. Hellhound! Now, let's see. Was that a useless spell? No. Because he's still alive. We were able to drag him up. He's not going to lose any more hit points, is he? <sighs> Alright, we got him back. These guys are still diseased, but they didn't... They didn't fail their saves and, you know, have ability damage. But now, we have to fight these Temple Guardians. So let's just get on that. Now, strike swiftly. And then we'll rest again. Until we... Well, I, this is not what I want. Fine. Just go back to your sword. Jeez. Critical hits, man. Get you every time. No, that's not what I wanted to do. But, whatever. Your date to X. Alright, so here we are. We're back here. I guess we'll just scorching Ray, the mummy. Quietly. Our quarry lies just ahead. Yes. And I guess you could just like that. Yeah, that's that's Damn a good your eyes. And you can't even move. Alright, it's dead. That's better. That's much better. There. All right. Fall in I say that we go explore this alcove, antechamber, what have you. Hmm. What? Turn on search mode. Fifty gold pieces, a weak fire essence, and a plus one longbow. We'll give that to Evelyn. Hmm. That'll be her new bow. What about over here? A bunch of gems. 
50 gold pieces, a potion of bark skin, and a duskwood plank. And over here, big fire essence, magic missile, color spray, a couple of cure potions. Definitely can use those. Can we rest in here? No, there's enemies that are close by. What? So what I wanted to do was I wanted to defeat the enemies that were up in here, but I accidentally clicked on the threshold of the door. And now we have to fight them again. I'll destroy ah. this. <laughs> oh my goodness. My, we won't both walk If I must. We won't both walk away from this. Ah. I'll destroy oh, this no, one. No, 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 no. That's very, very bad. Very bad. <laughs> That's not what I want. Is one of them dead? Yeah, actually. One is. That will require now, a mere fraction of my, my power. steel will strike true. What's up with you? Oh yeah. You got search mode. And <laughs> Evelyn, you have More to More lambs to the slaughter. You have to move backward. <laughs> You have to cure her as much as you can. Bon <laughs> Alright. Bon and what's going on here? Nothing. Alright, can we rest now? Can it happen? No, it can't happen. Bon There's more with Okay, that I'll tell you what's from. gonna happen. I'm going to defeat these enemies off camera, and then I'm going to keep resting until I'm able to rest without being attacked, and then I'll come back. Alright, we're back, and as you can see, I rolled a 1 on my Fortitude save versus disease, so now what? Sanjay has a minus 1 modifier to his hit points per level. That's bad. I don't like that. So we're going to have to drink a potion. This thing is called Mummy's Tea. It does remove disease, so we're going to drink that. Now his hit points are back up to 45, where they should be. Mm. Alright, I guess we should yes. put on some buffs. We'll just do this. Very Downs. well. Alright. Let us go back back to where we were and then we'll probably put on some buffs over here also off camera I created a scroll of scorching ray just a single variety and a scroll of fireball with the two blank scrolls that we had used up a lot of gold but we still have about 7,000 gold yeah we're not too bad of a spot hmm? Yenpei Yei Koroi. very well your dick to X. Yes? Your dick to X. Your dick to X. Anything else that we should be putting on? Dear John Queedy. Maybe we'll just save him. Your dick to X. What? Oh yeah, that's right. Hmm? That one. Yenpei Yekoro. Fall in behind me here. Yeah, we have a door over here. What is behind this door? Skeleton Archer? Skeleton Archer. Spectral Knight. Spectral Knight. I can't hmm? really see. Can you? What else is in here? Ah, skeletal mage. Very well. You, sir, will have silence cast on you. Perhaps so. Frito, you just kind of run in here. Yes. You do blades of fire on him. You just follow me and stay close. And let's do divine favor on ourselves. This only lasts for a minute. That will require a mere fraction of my power. 
see if it'll work. Perhaps so. All right, you come and attack the archer. Let's see. Oh, he succeeded. He rolled a 15. Oh, my goodness. Do it again. Now, strike swiftly. Okay, you have a fireball that I want to use. So let's let's roast somebody. Let's let's roast that skeleton. Okay, since you have divine favor on, why don't you come and attack? Oh my goodness! He closed the door. Yeah. Oh, what happened? You're dazed? That's bad. So he rolled another 15. So our spells were completely useless against him, and now we're probably going to be adversely affected by it. If I must. I say, if this doesn't work... Oh. Oh, you killed a skeleton archer with that. Cool. That one's near death. I say you just shoot a magic missile at it. That'll probably work. You probably need to get out of the frame. Your end draws nigh. All right, the mage is dead. Got 113 XP out of that, but we're still dazed. Okay, you can probably cast grease on these guys. Well, you keep doing that. Look what we have Actually, here. Actually, can you try to turn? Future corpses. All right, crew. Let's take them down. All right, looks like a war off. So let's let's go in. Oh, let me help out. <laughs> you are doing very badly. Do we have a potion to give her? Blast! Can you move out of here? Uh. Ow. Alright, drink. Attack! Let's do many scorching rays on that. Yes, of course. Uh. 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 Let me guess, you missed on a ranged touch attack. We won't. Whoa, what happened to your bow? I guess you ran out of arrows. That sucks. Stop casting that. I'm just gonna waste it. Ready to die, are you? Grab these fire arrows over here. What, one fire arrow? Better make it count. Alright. Damn your eyes. What are you doing? You're trying to attack, but you can't? This. Well, at least you're hitting it. There goes Bless. All right, it's dead. Any more monsters? No. Hmm. Alright, we got a bow, but 
the skeleton ran out of arrows, and then we have these treasure bags up here on these pedestals, and I don't think we have any shot of getting these. Sucks. Oh well. Very well. Crestalak the Black Wolf, but we don't have the option to attack him. We're gonna have to parlay. At last, the mighty adventurer stands before me. To what do I owe this uh, honor? I take it you were expecting me. I have been observing your progress since you first stepped foot into my realm. It was only a matter of time before you made your way here. So tell me, why have you come? I would know who you are, spirit. In life... I was Kresselak, the Black Wolf. In death, I am nothing. A mere shadow, cursed to haunt these halls. Why are you cursed? Mm, why, indeed. That is a tale long in the telling. Would you hear it? Yes, I am listening. As a young man, I was a conqueror. I ravaged the lands and brought all who opposed me under my rule. I built a kingdom upon the corpses of my enemies, and I reveled in the glories of war. However, in time my sword grew heavy, my aim less true, and I realized I was growing old. For the first time in my life, I knew fear. Realizing that death would someday claim me, I returned to my homeland. For months, I pondered what course I should pursue in my remaining years. I thought of my kingdom and all that I'd fought to create, but it was meaningless to me. A kingdom lasts a lifetime, but death lasts an eternity. I decided to forsake all that I had wrought in life for a place in the afterlife. What did you do? I ordered this tomb built in utmost secrecy and squandered the wealth of my kingdom doing so. Upon its completion, I traveled here with my most faithful followers to survey the work. Finding all in order, I slew the workers and buried them in the Vale outside. My faithful followers I sacrificed to become the guardians of this tomb. Finally, I sacrificed myself to my god, hoping to stand at his side in the land of the dead. Little did I know that my actions would instead bind me to these halls for eternity. A just reward for deeds so foul, spirit. I do not know. I have had centuries to reflect upon my life and my deeds. I can see the wisdom in your words. Perhaps justice is served. I seek the evil that plagues Kolahar. Would that be you? If it is evil that you seek, then you need look no further. I stand here before you. However, I am not the one who plagues Kaldahar. For that evil, you must look elsewhere. Having heard of your past deeds, why should I believe you to be innocent? I care not at all whether you believe me, adventurer. I am centuries dead and bound to these halls for eternity. I care even less for the living or their gathering places. If your Kaldahar is beset by evil, it is not of my doing. Go seek your villain elsewhere. If not you, then who is responsible? Who indeed? I can answer your question, but I require a boon first. Perform a task for me, and I will answer you. What task, spirit? Oril, the ice goddess, is worshipped by some here in the cold north. Oral commands her followers to extinguish all fires, to open structures to the cold winds, and to deny warmth a place to gather. As you can see, my tomb would be an abomination to a follower of Aurel. I can see your point. Go on. 
A priestess of Aurel has stood at the threshold of my tomb and gazed within. Recently she attempted entry, but my guardians foiled her. Now that you have slain my guardians, there is nothing to prevent her from returning and carrying out the will of Aurel. I do not wish to spend eternity in a cold, lightless hell. Find this Aurelite and slay her. Only then will I answer you. I am no assassin, spirit. Know this, adventurer. Your precious Kaldaha is just as much an abomination to Aurel as this tomb. Think of the great tree, the circle of warmth, and the tenets of Aurel. How will Kaldaha fare under Aurel's cold gaze? Find this Aurelite and slay her. Only then will both of us feel safe, and only then will I answer you. Well, I guess we have no choice. Very well. I'll find this priestess and deal with her. Excellent. Be quick about the task, for even now I sense her presence within the veil. Return to me when you have dealt with her. Until then, I have nothing more to say. Farewell, spirit. Okay, so according to the journal, he's asked us to slay this Aurelite priestess, whom he thinks intends to destroy his tomb. So, we agreed to find the priestess and deal with her, but not necessarily slay her. In any case, Kresselak says that he senses her presence within the Veil of Shadows. We should begin our search there. Maybe we can peacefully convince her to leave the veil and then he will not sense her anymore and then we can say that we dealt with her and then we'll get the information we need about who is plaguing Kuldahar will we be able to find out find out next time this is Big Los signing off thanks for watching I'll see you next time and Tango Windia